Hello and welcome my friend and then I am planning to give you information that how to remove bad smell or odor from car or truck inside area. And this is really easy and free way what we can do by self. And this is really tested. I have tested that thing in my cars. And now we can remove this process and cleaning these all smoke items, cigarette, sm cigarette smell, topa tobacco smell, and mold if this is a little bit wet car, and dog smell, cat smell, and all bad odors like also this gasoline smell and thinner smell inside in this our car. Okay, and how this happens? We need to first, we need to have some place where what is windy and sunny. And in California we have that kind of days really much and also in all another areas we can find day what is sunny and also windy. Okay, and then when we are doing this our service, most important thing is to open this our cars, all doors. If we have like sedan like I, I have, then I need to open all of these four doors and also trunk door, trunk door full open. And that means that these doors are like in that way. And what is suitable place for this car odor and smell cleaning and removing? What is excellent place to remove this car inside area smell and bad odors? These good areas are if we have some fresh area where is fresh air and of course we have to be in outside. This is a little bit difficult to do this cleaning in inside or some garage because we need this fresh air about eight hours. Eight hours we have to be in outside and this windy area and excellent places to keep our doors open are if we have own, own private area in countryside or in some forest cabin or then in sea. We have this great sea beaches in California and if we open these doors in beach area so that wind goes inside. This is the very important and I will show that how this wind must go and then if we are in highways or cities it is not good place because this air is so dirty in those places and then we go to look at how this wind must go in the wind must go in this direction that it goes in inside this is the key point that we have to install our car in uh, like in faced on that wind, that wind goes in here and idea is that it goes through in that area inside and when our doors are open then wind goes in and in another door to out. And let's go to look this thing in outside. Okay, and now this my wind is going in this direction and it goes in directly in inside in here and then this door keeps this movement also in nicely in this direction. That it is good to install our car so that wind goes in this direction. That idea is that wind goes inside in cabin area. This is the key point. If we install that car so that wind is in this direction, then it can't go in in because these doors are like this facing this thing. This is important. And that's 
these doors are like wi wings in here. Good.